Now that we are a king, we have access to our prime minister slot, our last court slot that we'll unlock, as well as this uh, fifth administrator we got down here. And after looking at all the bonuses we get from everyone, I think Sun Quan is our best option because we get another available assignment, plus eight satisfaction, plus two public order, uh, and some faction support and military supplies and things like that. Um, and I find that most useful. So we're going to bump him up. Uh, so that means we can promote someone else. And for the administrator, I'm going to pull this guy over here. Not only does he get minus 26% construction costs, but uh, plus 40% income, commerce, silk, and spice. And we're about to take over some silk. Um, and plus 15% uh, income from industry. That's a you know, decent amount there. So, And I think we're just going to put him right on top of the new city we just took over, Chanong. Chan, Chan Eng. I, I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that right. And then that means we have a grand director we still need to fill. And I kind of want to just put uh, Lady Tsai in here and Liu Biao's wife. Um, she's kind of the highest level of the ones remaining down here. We could do this one. She's one of our generals. But no one is really hurting for satisfaction, so I think I'm just going to give it to her. There we go. Look at that. Fantastic. Court is filled out, so we don't have to mess with that anymore. Unless we want to make some type of change, but like I said, satisfaction is not really an issue. Um, so yeah. So we have a whole bunch of buildings that were just finished. Killed in battle. Oath sworn. Friends. Oathsworn friends and Oathsworn, great. All right, and here's all of our, all the uh, triggers we just got from the king, including that one we just learned how how it works. A new faction capital, occupation, sure. Yeah, and we're probably just going to turn around and declare war on the Han Empire right after vassalizing them because they unvassalize themselves, which is super cool. Super cool mechanic there. All right, so we got the grain storage in there. It's at plus nine, so we're going to do the uh, anti-corruption here. I think, oh, man, there's so many buildings to build here. I should probably put a construction person here as well. We have another assignment available. Yeah, we'll put we'll put her here. Yeah, I think we'll start with this one. Try and get the, uh, or actually, these only take one, and the next turn the bonus will kick in. So that'll only be three. Let's do, we'll do this one, I guess. Or we'll pop that one in there so we can get some anti-corruption. Yep, we'll just upgrade that one. This one, we want to work on the state workshop, anti-corruption. Just want to put it in every single place. We're not gonna upgrade these two I think all right so that one has one turn left um, I do want to take a closer look all right so those three are gonna be demolishing repairing these so we have six slots and only a jade mine here so I imagine this will just be a money a money place so we want grain storage so what do we have tea parlor which one is that yeah we'll we'll convert that one That one's fine. Wait, which marketplace? Okay, so we'll we'll definitely do a grain storage. Switch that one to the anti-corruption. Probably do a lodging and then something else. Maybe a private workshop? I don't know. Okay, uh, I think I'm done messing with buildings, so let's start marching. Let's go ahead and get the jade mine. No mercy! Delegate. Oh, close victory. Ooh, didn't Authority mean to do that. Probably should have manually taken that one. It will prosper for the better. I guess it won't my... really matter that much. We're still, yeah. Two, three, three turns. Three turns until they're all full. It'll be three turns before he's even out of the territory. Oh, maybe not. Well, he should be able to walk over and take that. So if we go up this way in one of these directions. Yeah, he'll be fully replenished. Uh, we'll go ahead and get our... Oh wait, which one? I want 
that one actually. There we go. Alright, you need to get out of that stance and let's take that over. Delegate. Order has been restored. And we will I guess come right here. Be ready to move. We'll take over farmland next. Oh, he has yellow turbans coming after him already. Are you doing bad on food? No, you have food. I guess public order is just absolute garbage for you. Alright, this guy needs to march over, pick some stuff up. I wonder if I can just convince the Han Empire they want to be my vassal, like the old way. Because I don't want to have to fight through all this to get down here. I kind of just want to walk through. Uh, flexibility, one million percent, yes. This one, yeah, melee evasion, great. Sun Quan, where are you? Alright, so, public order. Public order? Why does it say remove? Why does it say two different people use this? Alright, that was weird. Alright, so this guy, I think he gets us a total of six. Six public order? For everyone? Alright, uh, is anyone on? Yep. Okay, you're under, under nine. Just that one. Oh, two here. Oh, and this one too. What are we building? Grain silo can be upgraded. We'll have to upgrade the city. Alright, so that one will slowly tick down, slowly tick down. This should... We'll go in the negative a tiny bit here, but we have so many armies right around it. Our capital city is our angriest location. Why do we have food here? We... Oh, this has been left here for... A hundred turns, I think. That needs to be a grain storage. That's probably why we have public order problems here. Oh, man. I'm gonna go ahead and spend the money to switch that. Jeez. <laughs> that was kind of a huge oversight there. Oh, well. Uh, we have it corrected. It only costs us a couple extra thousand. Let's look at our diplomacy status. We have a lot of territory. The Han is not upset with us yet. I think I want to take it. Uh, do I take advantage of getting 10,000 a turn for a couple turns? Or do I go ahead and get another army? I think I'll wait. 48% corruption over here. Jeez. Let's look at our money makers, make sure we're not killing it with corruption. So 20%, 13, 29, e. Where's this? Oh, it's down here. Don't really have many of the neighboring commanderies. All right, enough of that. Let's, so anyone need to move? So you're still just kind of standing there. I guess we keep them there still. Oh, we need to switch some of these out. Let's do some Pearl Dragons. Yeah, we'll leave that. So four melee units, four spears, four cavalry, and then our typical uh, trebuchet and crossbows. I think it's okay like that. It's a cost some traders. Look at that, we did it. Um, build undercover network. Oh, we can we can get another spy. We actually do want to use this. Who do we want to get rid of though? Maybe this guy. I want you to spy on them. I want to see what they're up to. There we go. Uh, we have more trade agreements now. Who do we want to trade with though? Not the Han Empire because we're gonna go to war with them, like very soon. Are we not trading with our own vassal? 
Okay, well, let's <laughs> straighten with our vassal. All right, great. We accept your offer. You sure do. Oh, we still have we have another trade agreement. Uh, uh this guy. Who are you? I can't actually see this guy. <laughs> uh, let's trade with him though. Oh, it is you. It is me. We'll take some more money. I think this should show us where his capital is. We accept your offer. I'm so glad. Confederate. No one wants to be confederated, of course. Create vassal. No nope. military access. Uh, I don't even know where you are yet. None of that and none of that. Nope. All right, so currently only two kingdoms are at war with each other. Or maybe the kingdom of Ba declared war on Song. Uh, maybe I saw that. I think we're ready to hit the button. It is winter time. All right, some more war. Peace treaty. Peace treaty. Peace treaty. Did he get vassalized? Spy was promoted to general. Ooh, campaign movement range. That's good. Lots of buildings. All right, let's close all those out. Um, and let's go ahead and do do a little marching Good first. Coffee. Wow, you don't go very far. Attack! Man. Okay. You're not going to make it all the way. So I guess we'll just get to the edge March. here. Be able to take that over easy next turn. That's our that's our good buddy, the spy, Sun Quan. Let's go ahead and take this one over first. Leave none alive. Decisive, yeah, we'll delegate. All right, so we have one of the silk traders now. Nice little boost to the income. Well, once we get the other one, of course. A fine settlement. We will take uh, extra experience for our sentinel. Great, red thoroughbred. Red thoroughbred horse. We'll have to assign that to someone. Actually, maybe you. Instinct. There you go. Good job. Someone gain a point? Or is someone low on. Okay. You got a point. Yeah, we'll get the, uh, the the attack. Let's go ahead and give you that wedge. I think I'm gonna give you the other wedge one too. Not that I'll remember to use it, but oh, let's use this one. All right, so Sun Quan, we want to move you. We want to stay in your territory. I think we'll move north this way. Let Lubu just skip and take all this over. And Sun Quan can work this way. Pirate guy will get this one and possibly move up this way. We'll take over this one. Yeah, we're I mean we're just gonna roll over all of his territory. So there's the line. We can just slide up right here. We'll be fine. And there's the bridge. We'll go up this way. Really wish I could use this guy on something, but I, I hate that he's sitting here, but possibly if we move him away. You know, like, recall him and then recruit him over here to move down this way. We, I mean, we could be in a fight with uh, Kingdom of Song by then. So, I'm just going to leave him there. As bad as it makes me feel. Alright, take that one. Oh, I guess, oh yeah, Rice Patty. We'll take this one next. Livestock farm. Do that there. Okay. So many things to do in buildings. All right, plus two. Not going to worry about this one for a while, probably. Uh, yes, on the anti-corruption one. This one. Okay, yeah, we are going to upgrade that one, and that'll put us back in the positive. Still have plus 19 food. That doesn't mean we want to go around upgrading a bunch of these, though. That'll only do four. That'll only cost us four, I mean. I think we'll leave it for now. All right, it's got lots of stuff to do here. We'll need to convert that one. That takes three turns though. So grain storage for sure. Negative two. 
I don't think I want to wait. I think I want to invest a little bit. That'll bump it up to four. For another 600. Jeez. <laughs> All right, down to eight. Um, maybe we just build like we did in the other territories we took over. Maybe just a tiny bit of military infrastructure here has been reached. just to balance us out until you know we have like all the faction support we're only at half it's at negative three and minus uh minus income yeah so let's throw that down i am not gonna i'm not gonna make that one go quick yeah, we'll just leave it at that. Still don't think we want to do anything here. I should probably switch these others to anti-corruption. But it's anti-corruption here, I believe. I kind of want to get rid of this. Plus eight public order, that'll put it in minus two. It's a small regional city. What do we need to, to get the highest one here? I should probably do this. Can we get it? It'll take us two. I have to do that one and then that one. The other one is salary. I wonder if there's another public order. Oh, here's public order. Oh, that's quite pretty far away. That's actually a pretty decent line to go down. Lots of negative corruption. Why don't I do that one? This one requires uh, the uh, rural tax office. All right, that's what we're going to do. Let's find a place where we can just very quickly make a tax office. That is not a place we just took over. How uh, do we not have an empty thing anywhere? All right, that was kind of poor planning on my part. I, I should have unlocked that like way sooner. There. Uh, we'll let that tick next turn. Upgrade that one. I think we'll just get some food going because I do eventually want to upgrade a couple of these to the larger cities. And we're at plus eight here so let's get rid of that. And we'll just do that one. All right, I think that's all I want to do for buildings. Everyone has moved. Everyone has points. I think we're just set. It's gonna be a lot of building upgrade stuff in the next couple turns, especially when we're making 14K a turn. That's pretty good. Still don't have my, my guy married. Yeah, no one wants to marry. I think I'm just gonna, just in case, very... Um, I can marry like one of these people. Oh, I can marry her. How old is she? 31, all right. I'm just gonna do this. There you go, you guys will be married. She'll be super happy. You can start having kids just in case I don't know, disaster happens and everyone freaking dies. Okay, anyway. Um waste of waste of four thousand gold, if you ask me. But alright, let's uh let's hit the go button. You would not need fear us. He wants to pay us for a non aggressive pack. I still don't know where you are. I'm almost positive he's over here somewhere. I mean, this is fine, I guess. Like we have a trade agreement going, and I want to keep that. So, sure. I bid you farewell. We have plenty of other targets. We don't need to worry about expanding over his territory. Still trying to get rid of the yellow turban guys. Uh, Kingdom is out, and Kong Rong formed a coalition. Peace. New faction heir. Okay, or uh, leader. Spy dispatched. All right, so before I forget, we're wanting to do this one, public order. 
Very good. And then we'll just go straight down that line. Corruption is going to be our biggest thing to worry about um, once we start doing all this hyper expanding. Sun Quan is now creative. Contr uh, minus 5% construction costs for everyone. Fantastic. Guy is still walking across our territory. Okay, it's in the positive. Don't need to worry about upping that one. Everything is kind of locked behind. Oh, yeah. Locked behind uh, reform stuff. I guess I could go ahead and just do this one. We can upgrade it to six. Let's just do that one for now. Oh, we have a we have a free assignment. I think I'm gonna do 30% industry. Let's figure this out. Okay, we're we're even on public order. Let's see if there's something we can get in here that doesn't take forever to build. Commerce and industry. I think the private workshop would work pretty well here. Labor or private work? I think private private workshop. Then we'll possibly switch that one over to labor for the plus industry. This will need to get converted for sure. Alright, we can get rid of this now. Don't want to lock this up. So two turns for that one, it should be fine. I think we'll just upgrade the tea parlor. That's fine. Upgrade here. And we'll leave everything else alone. All right, let's move some armies. Almost completely replenished. I am not gonna worry about those last little bits. I think we'll just start moving up. So let's walk to this bridge. That's an army. Yellow turban army. Destiny awaits. Okay, well, we can take it over and then kill them. So that's fine. We'll do their job for them. I think we can make it all the way down here. Get trade Kill silk trader all. number two. Delegate. Victory was never in Ooh. Doubt. I think they're already hurt. This belongs to us now. Uh pay um terrible collapse. Yeah, we'll definitely pay. We have plenty of money, we'll pay. That gets us satisfaction, right? Yeah. Not that we really need to worry about it, but My Lord, you gained a point. Look at you. Request. I think we're gonna go this way. So one, two, three, and then four. I'm gonna give you this one just because it gives more expertise and resolve. All right, so you should be able to march down this way. Looks like Mating is kind of all around here. What's our relationship look like? Not great. Might end up having to fight him. So you're good. Mr. Pirate Man, let's take this over. Spread in all directions. Delegate. Order has been restored. A fine settlement. The white thoroughbred horse. Put that on a commander. Do you already have a fancy horse? No. All right, you can get this one. All right, let's go ahead and. Move you Strike rice patties. Close. You need to move. I think we can take it without issue. Yep. Yeah, we're just. Oh man. Oh no, we can delegate. I was thinking we'd have to sit there for a turn because of the was a siege. Took quite a bit of damage here. We'll have to replenish for a couple turns. Two turns. Not bad. Three turns there. Oh, four turns. I think we'll start moving out on turn three. Yeah, I'm not worried about public order around here. What is this? Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Well, we're up to 53 food. Are you out of food now? Minus four food. Success. That was that was uh, our mission with moving up here to take the take over these. Cut off his food. So, not that you know. We're gonna steamroll him anyway, but now he at least has negative public order and the other uh, debuffs you get. Okay, we got a bow too. Just looking for something. There we go. You you don't have stuff. There you go. Now you have stuff. Okie dokie. Oh man, he got really hurt in that siege. Jeez, it was like only garrison. 
How many turns? Four turns? Four turns? Jeez, probably should have manually done that fight. I think these are all set, right? Alright, just out of curiosity, if we really, really tried hard on Empire, <laughs> could get him to join our coalition. Alright, let's see. How about vassalize the Han? Oh, jeez. Well, that is just never gonna happen. Okay, never mind. We will very much likely be declaring war on the Han Empire very soon. Alright, 15k. I think I think we'll do one more turn of just raking in cash and then we'll we'll raise an army right here and just start our way down probably start with the rice baddies just go like this do you literally only have, you there's no way you only have one commandery okay there you go I guess it's just all we can see because we're not currently yeah attempting to infiltrate I guess since we brought it up, we might as well do this. There you go, and... He can't even do anything. That's fine. Alright, what else do we need to work on here? We're all good up there with our armies. I'm curious what our... All are how... On the field. How is he superior to us? Can't really see what what all their wealth looks like. Is that negative food though? Hmm. I mean, we can still recruit armies, and we can feed our people. So there's that too. Of course, a lot of our trade deals we would lose. We'd lose that one. We're probably gonna lose Kong Rong here in a minute because they're in a coalition with the uh, Kingdom of Zhao. Yeah, we're like trading with all of you on shoes vassals. Alright, let's end turn. Your claim as emperor is deceitful and insulting. So he asked for a non-aggressive pack, and then we get a trade deal going with him, and now he declares war on us. Oh, Ma Ting, too. Circumstances have changed. Oh man. Trade agreement broken. Alliance of Hansu declared war on the Kingdom of Shu. So it's Ma Ting and this guy. Finest armor. All right, let's let's have a look. Jeez. Well, I'm not too concerned. Not you again. Ma Ting is weak. Well, I think we can just turn our attention with Lu Bu. To Ma Ting. I, I mean, that, that kind of like opens us up right there. Should just be able to slide right over and take it. Alright, let's get out of this. Yeah, we can take horse pastures immediately. We have these three guys. That'll just take over the Kingdom of Zhao. The only thing I'm worried about is him kind of like walking through this way. So maybe I'll just bring him back. I don't like how he cancelled our trade agreement. He doesn't like us very much. Well, we'll have to look for a new trade agreement. We'll probably move him back. And then we'll recruit someone down down here to start the long march. Oh, okay. We can see we can see everything now. Four territories, it looks like. Oh. Oh. Wow. They're kind of more spread out than I thought. They have all the... they have spices. Alright, either way, we'll recruit an army here and just kind of leapfrog until we eventually make it down here. We'll just commit one army to it, because we're not really concerned with how strong this guy is. Um, we are, however, concerned with how strong he is and all of his vassals and we don't have much in terms of defense over here so we need to end this quick and hopefully Lubu can just hold off all this and then we can quickly move all these guys to our kind of to the central plains to defend our north 
So I don't I don't think this is gonna last very long, this coalition we have here. So there we have it. Um, making steady progress. It's only the uh, war of two kings right now, but soon to be the war of four kings. Um, so yeah, thanks so much for watching. Thanks for stopping by. We'll see you next time.